All right, we've been at it for the last couple of hours here in the home office. Uh, welcome to your Tuesday, December the 11th, 2018, with your Pratt Pack. Here are your headlines. President Donald Trump Friday was implicated by prosecutors in two crimes suggested by his former attorney, Michael Cohen. Democrats are suggesting the president committed an impeachable offense and could be sent to prison in the aftermath. Republicans are questioning whether Cohen's story was credible, saying they want to reserve judgment until all the facts come out from special counsel Robert Mueller. Meanwhile, the president clashed today with top White House and Senate Democrats over funding for the border wall and the prospects of a government shutdown during an Oval Office meeting that was open to the press to sign up what a divided government in Washington might look like next year. Time Magazine has chosen The Guardians, a group of journalists who have been targeted for their work as Person of the Year. A series of four black and white covers highlights what the magazine calls the War on Truth. The group includes Jamal Khashoggi, the Washington Post contributor who was killed at the Saudi Arabian consulate in Istanbul in October. Another cover features Wai Alone and Kawasu, two Reuters journalists who were arrested one year ago while working on stories about the killing of Muslims. The Guardians also includes the journalists at the Capitol Gazette, the Annapolis, Maryland newspaper, where five employees were murdered by a gunman last June. Senate Foreign Relations Chairman Bob Corker plans to offer a measure as soon as today to rebuke Saudi Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman, the formal response to the murder of Jamal Khashoggi. And television icon Kathy Lee Gifford will bid farewell to NBC's Today Show next April. She wants to focus her attention full-time to her other creative endeavors. That's a look at your headlines. Have a great day from your Pratt Pack.